The Intelligent Design of Life This video provides an overview of three of my videos to summarize the design of life, such as explaining the purpose and design for animals, love, children, and sexuality. The design of life becomes obvious if we make two assumptions. Reincarnation exists. Reincarnation was designed by angels to make new angels out of souls. Reincarnation evolves the body. Souls start with something simple like algae that has no movement, no free will, and unable to determine your destiny. Reincarnation to plants introduces souls to having a basic need like the sun, a basic movement like growing your body to reach towards the sun. There are movements such as wiggling as worms like training for having a future backbone. Sprout rudimentary appendages as fishes as training for your future arms and legs. Learn to use arms, legs, fingers, and toes as bigger animals. The goal is to evolve a human body which resembles the likeness of your angel body. Reincarnation evolves the mind. You learn basic social needs while responding to chemical signals like pheromones and colonies of ants and bees. You follow a leader in animal schools and herds like among fishes and deers. You become a team member among animal families like apes and elephants. As a human being, you can independently pursue goals that are invisible, abstract, and unselfish, contributing to society even while solo. Love exists. So you seek the company of human beings contrasted to selfishly taking all resources and killing all competitors. Therefore, you practice cooperation and learn goodness because you are motivated by attraction and love. Children exist. So you have a meaning of life, a purpose to live day by day. So you learn to be unselfish while caring for your children, where you learn to vicariously focus on your children's needs, thoughts, and feelings. You learn science and rationality while learning to care and protect the physicality of your children against the permanence of reality, and you think about the details of life while explaining the universe to your children. Through your children, you learn the needs of people to care and love people, learning to become a future angel to then help raise future souls to angels in turn. Sexuality exists. Heterosexuals can produce their biological meaning of life through children to practice platonic love and unselfish care for other human beings. After experiencing the heterosexual family arrangement for multiple lives, especially when the novelty of sexual intimacy wears off, heterosexuals can grow tired of the differences between men and women. When sex becomes boring and unimportant to you across time, you will value friendship more, such as friendship with same-sex friends, which develops into homosexuality after reincarnating through lives. Homosexuals are designed to not produce children, therefore will seek meaning among adults after practicing caring for children in previous lives as heterosexuals. Homosexuals will look outside of the isolation of families to seek meaning of life through social and public contributions, becoming more like angels who work with existing souls instead of finding meaning by producing children. This complex design of life exists because Immortality can be a curse if you are not ready for it, where flaws dragged out for eternity can become your hell. Therefore, this design exists to maximize your potential to become an immortal who can find happiness for eternity. To be eternally happy among other angels, you will need to be good in order to achieve harmony and peace with other immortals. As such, this complex design of life exists to maximize your success as an angel, so your immortal life is heavenly rather than hellish, for your sake and sanity contrasted to some sort of arbitrary exclusivity. This summary video means to entice your interest, so you will want to watch my other videos. Reincarnating to an angel also discusses additional differences between animals and humans. Describes the purpose of death and how death is trippy because angels will never know what death feels like. Sex, children, and angels also goes into deeper depths about sex, children, and sexuality. Discusses the design for gender. The immortal life of an angel also. 
describes what is behavior in the logical requirements for an angel. Explores how immortals find eternal happiness. These three videos describe the core concepts for the logical design of life to produce new angels out of souls through reincarnation. There are other videos that describe supplemental details about this design, like Skin Color, Beauty, and Angels explains the design and purpose of race and beauty. And there are other videos that discuss topics unrelated to this design of life. Please be sure to explore among my videos. This video summarizes the intelligent design that produces new angels out of souls, therefore explaining the purpose for animals, love, children, and sexuality to exist in our world and in our lives. Hopefully this overview motivates you to seek further enlightenment. Thanks for watching.